Hi there, it's Arena. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. I missed you guys so very much and I wanted to apologize for the fact that I haven't been posting in the past few months. I tried to film a few videos but I just really hated how any of them turned out so none of them ever really saw the light of day. But it's a new year. Happy new year! So I'm gonna try and get back into it and I'm doing a yes style haul. 2021 some new clothes 2021 is going to be a cute year so i needed some cute pieces to go with it so i'm starting off the year with a yes style haul i know how much you guys love my yes style videos and i personally love working with yes style so of course if you do like any of these pieces feel free to use my discount code a-r-e-n-n-a-a -A at checkout i will also be leaving all the pieces down below so it's easy for you guys to find them if you want to have a look so let's just jump right in i'm going to start off with tops because i have a few and i feel i realize i have like three of everything almost but the first top that i wanted to show you is this really cute frilly white top that i picked up it's a cute white frilly off the shoulder long sleeve and it has so much gorgeous detailing in it there's frill lining at the top and also some frills at the bottom there's like a zipper down the middle which makes it so easy to put on and off which i really like but it has such a gorgeous long sleeve it has a ribbon at the top here and another one just at the bottom and it flares out a lot so you can actually wear it with like a full flared sleeve because it comes out like you can really adjust the like style of the sleeve so you can wear it really wide and flared out or you can kind of tie it up so it kind of gathers at the bottom and comes out a little bit and flares out which I think is so cute. I prefer it like this because I think it's like really cute. But you can wear it so many different ways and I really like it. It's so cute. I can't wait to wear it. I really like it. And the next top that I got, the next two that I got are a little bit more casual than that one. That one's a little cute and fancy. But I got this really nice. I just like loved the cut of this jumper. It's a really cute square necked jumper. I feel like I love this because it's a jumper so it's comfortable but it looks like fashionable because it has like a square neck and then the sleeves are puffy and I love puffy sleeves. I feel like they just add such a cute detail to a fit so I love it. So it kind of get it's like flared out and then it gathers because it's like tight on your wrist and then it comes out like a balloon, a cute balloon sleeve moment and it just has like a square neck and there's like a little bit of detailing so there's like two lines on the side. It's a little cropped as well. So it's a really stylish jumper. So while being really fashionable, it's also super comfortable, which of course I love. I got this in a size medium too. I really, really want to pick up more of these in different colors because I really love the style and the cut. And I don't really wear dark colors that much. I think they had two options, black and gray. And obviously I opted for the gray because I don't wear black that much. But I honestly might pick up the black because I could wear that to work. And it's so cute. I love it so much. I really want to find more of those in different colors but I also picked up another gray item and it is this really cute gray cardigan this is another piece that I really want to find in other colors as well because I actually love this cardigan it's just like a balloon sleeves as I I don't know why I'm obsessed with balloon sleeves I just think that they add so much I feel like they just look so cute when you wear them but this is a cropped cardigan so honestly when you wear it it kind of just looks like you're wearing a sleeve and you'll see it when I try it on how it kind of sits but I just really like how it looks I feel like it's so cute I really need to find this in other colors as well because I really really like it um what size did I pick this up in oh it's one size so this sweater is one size and it's over it's like pretty big so I feel like it would fit a lot of different sizes but I absolutely love it it's baggy knitted it just Oh, it's so cute. Next, I'm going to go into my shorts and skirts because I picked up three. And I actually ordered these items while I was in lockdown. So I kind of feel like I gained a bit of weight. I got my lockdown. I gained a bit of lockdown weight. So a lot of the pieces that I'm talking about, I'm going to talk about next, are really like tight for me. So they do fit. I tried wearing them and honestly they all fit me. But getting them past my hips was a little bit of a struggle because I feel like I gained a bit of weight during lockdown. So you'll see it in the clips anyways because yeah, lockdown weight. <laughs> I need to start exercising but I honestly don't know if I will but I know I need to. 
Anyways, I picked up these really cute beige shorts and I've wanted beige shorts for the longest time. So I had to pick this pair up and I got this in a size small. And of course, in hindsight, I probably should have got it in M because it does fit me. But I would have loved like a little bit of extra room. Because as I said, getting in these past the hips was a little bit of a struggle. And there is really no stretch in them. But I feel like these pair of shorts just have such a clean cut to them. It's like all really symmetrical and clean. So there's like a stripe here and then a pocket. And I just really like how they look. But if you like have the same body as me, probably get them in an M. Just to have a little bit more room and just to make them a little bit more easier to get on and off. But the same also goes for this next piece, which is this really cute white pleated skirt. And I picked this one up in a size small as well, which I probably should not have done. So this one has the same issue. It was really hard to get past my waist. Actually, it was really hard to get past my like butt and my hips, but it does fit me and I can get it on. But in hindsight, I would have rathered an M. But I still really like how it looks. It's really cute. I've wanted a pleated skirt for the longest time, especially in white, because I don't have any really just like one color pleated skirts. And I feel like they're making like a comeback in fashion. So I love this piece. Really adorable tennis skirt. So cute. So many different ways to wear. Would match so many things. So the next piece is another cute white skirt. And this one was in one size. So I couldn't pick. But since it has an elastic waistband, I had literally no problems with it. It fits like a dream. And I absolutely adore it. It's white. And then it kind of frills out a little bit. And then there's lace detailing at the bottom. Sorry, I just realized you couldn't see. But I think... Yeah, that's the front. So it has like the... I think if you can see, I need to iron it out a little bit. But it kind of like has a detail where it comes up a little bit on the right side. And then it comes down into like a really cute frilly lacing. And I feel like this is so cute. I really can't wait to wear this. I feel like it's going to be so comfortable as well because it does have an elastic waistband. But I feel like the lace just adds like a little detail. You could wear this with a jumper or like something cute. But I love this skirt and I cannot wait to wear it. I feel like I've been getting really into girly things recently. I've always liked girly stuff. But I've always been such a hardcore shorts girl, but recently I've always found myself wanting to wear like skirts and dresses. But I have nothing wrong with it. Maybe it's just summer, but I absolutely love it. I love this skirt. I think it's so cute. I love the lace detailing. And those were the three bottoms that I picked up. The next three pieces that I'm going to talk about are my dresses that I got. And I also had the same issue with some of the dresses. But the first one that I want to talk about is this really, really cute button up dress. I actually wore this for Christmas. When I had Christmas dinner, I wore this dress because I thought it was so cute and I actually love it. It's just like those really nice, really long um, bun up tops. So it's pretty thin, I will say. It's pretty see-through. You would probably have to wear like a nude bra or something if you were just wearing the dress. But it has this thin, white, really comfortable, really airy. Um, long sleeve and it comes down a little long but it also did come with the shorts which I appreciate because I don't think it, it doesn't button up the whole way so you can kind of see your bottom so it comes with a pair of shorts just to keep you extra safe which I love so those are the shorts and then it is a button up collar top and it has like a little waistband that cinches in your waist which I really like I don't have it here with me but you'll see in the clip of me wearing it and this white dress was also one size and it fits perfectly it's like there's a lot of moving room it's pretty baggy so I feel like it would fit like a few different body sizes you have the waistband to tighten it so that's pretty good but I did wear this outfit for Christmas dinner and I also got this vest from YesStyle that I paired it with which is this really adorable beige knitted vest I love this I don't know I've really been like into vest this is my first vest and I know that I'm gonna get more because it is just absolutely adorable and now that I have that collared top I'm, I feel like I'm gonna wear it with all these different vests so I need to find more cute vests to wear it with but it has that braided knitting detail. I just really like it. I love the color of it. It just goes so well. It's super cute. And you could wear this with like pretty much any collar top. Like any jumper. But I just really like it. Um, so yeah, I paired those two together. And I really like how they look. But you could obviously pair them separately. Or wear them in different ways. The next dress that I want to talk about is this really cute blue puffy sleeved dress. And I got this in a size small. And I also had the same issue with it. I can get it on and it fits. 
like honestly it fits like a glove like it fits perfectly but putting this on was a little bit of a struggle because as i said it's really hard to get things past like my butt and my hips but once i got it on it fit perfectly it hugged me in all the right places and it looks really cute it has really gorgeous big puffy sleeves as i love it has like a sweetheart square neck which i find flattering on my body type so i really love it and it's really cute can't wait to wear this i just like ugh. puffy sleeved blue dresses just remind me of picnics so really excited to try that or oh, like to wear it the next dress is probably one of my favorites but is another dress that i had to really struggle to get into <laughs> And it is this gorgeous, silky, light blue gathered dress. And it has like a square neck. I feel like it's meant to do that thing where it kind of comes out a bit. But it kind of just sits like a square neck on me. So it doesn't really bunch up. It just sits like a square neck. But it has the sides that gather. So you can really adjust the length of the dress. And there's also a zip which makes it a lot easier to get in and out of. But I still struggled to get in and out of this one. And this one actually was in a size medium. And it was still a little bit of a struggle for me to get in and out of. So definitely have gained weight in lockdown. And oops. But yeah, it has really cute sleeves that you tie. So you can adjust the length of the straps and then you can adjust the length of the dress. So I really love this piece. Like honestly, I wanted to wear this for New Year's. If I went to a New Year's party this year, or last year, for this year, I would have worn this dress because it's absolutely beautiful. It's such a gorgeous New Year's dress. Like light blue, satin, it's perfect. But I didn't really do anything special for New Year's to wear this gorgeous of a dress for. So hopefully there's this year. Those were all for the clothing pieces that I picked up. But I did also pick up two accessories that I wanted to share with you guys. And the first one is this really cute lock necklace. So it has a gold, a thick gold chain with a lock on it. And it kind of has like a clasp that you can take the lock in and out of. So it kind of comes apart. And you can put the little clasp back in. I feel like you would probably wear it with it in because it would probably look weird dangling ah, if it wasn't clasped. But I mean, you can really wear it however you like. But I probably would wear it clasped because I don't know how it would look weird if it was just dangling. But it also has a cute little thin chain with a heart on it that's more like chokery. So the lock hangs and then the choker is a little bit more like, you know, I think it's so cute. I love a good necklace. So I got that piece. And then the next piece that I also got was this really adorable straw hat. Oh my god, I love it. I've wanted a hat like this for the longest time. And it has the cute frilly ends and then a ribbon. And it's one of those really cool ribbons that you can actually tie. I think the first time I saw a hat like this was when Mei Yan, like Princess Mei, was wearing it. And I thought it was so cute that I was like, I need to pick one up because she looks so cute wearing it. And I was like, I want to look cute too. Honestly, I don't know if it really suits me or not, but I think it's so cute. It is a little bit wonky because it did come a little bit like squashed in the mail. So I have to let it sit for a little longer so it's straight. Because I know there's like a few dents and it's not completely straight. But you know, it's okay. It's still really cute. Oh my god, I love it. I honestly don't know if I look crazy wearing it. But I still think it's really cute. And this is the last piece of my YesStyle haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.